Well, just looking, reading everything I can about no telling in that, I just got a feeling strip till would be an advantage, and especially with uh, banding fertilizer, the dry fertilizer. I just see a lot of advantages to that, both for the quality of water, soil, and keeping it here, and the plants. Corn roots, you know, it gives them a big trough to feed in instead of hunting around for their food. So, rather than I'm too cheap to go buy these new fancy things, don't know if it's going to work, I bought an old Case IH 900 planter, dry planter, chopped it into pieces in the shop. I had uh, anhydrous units that had a no-tail cutter, the knife, and disc sealers, so I mounted those on. Uh, welded inch tubes for the fertilizer to drop through, move, had to move the fertilizer boxes, but got everything arranged. Go ahead and use a regular drive on it. Uh, got it all calibrated, and it really is doing the job, working the ground up beautiful. It just opens it up. Last year it got me planted in mid-April uh, instead of I'd have had to finish in May, which around here would have cost me about 40 bushel an acre. So that gives me all the advantages of tillage with the ground drying and loose and warming up on these clay soils are cool. Uh, so that's basically the reason for it. And I also then, and that's the other reason I run it in the spring, a lot of times right ahead of the planter. Maybe an hour or two, a couple days, a week's fine, whatever. My soils roll a little bit, so I do not want to get early and get the erosion problems. That's the reason I've gone to no-till and cover crops. So I don't want to defeat that purpose. Well, it's got a straight cutter just to cut all the stalks and fodder and the roots and stuff. And then I run a mole knife with an inch tube for the dry fertilizer on it. I've got disc sealers, which just pull the dirt back and hump it a little bit. And then I fashion some uh, crumblers, I guess the best word to call it, or have some wheels with some bars across it, just to roll across the back which is necessary because of running it right ahead of the planter. I need that soil firmed up a little bit and make sure everything's closed up. So those crumblers do that, make it just like somebody's been across it with a field cultivator with a rolling basket is what it looks like. Mm -hmm.